We're just enough alike that we butt heads. And that, that's the honest truth. He and I are, granddad and I, we're, we're just alike. We're at LNH Davis Farms, and we're located in Welch, Texas. We grow cotton and peanuts. We raise probably a third of the cotton that's raised in the USA, right here in the 25 county area. My father uh, bought this, this farm here in 51. This will be my 57th crop. There's been some good times, there's been some hard times. Two years ago, we had a really good year. Once you planted it, it just went. I mean, everything clicked, everything was in line. And then last year, it was a little bit harder. And then this year, as it was pretty hard to get anything started this year. We had two straight weeks, 100 and 105, 110 degrees, and then trying to get a little old plant up, it's pretty hard. It's been a big learning curve. It's not as easy as I thought. I thought you plant the seed, you fertilize it, you water it, and hey, we, we collect it all in the fall and we go on with our business. A lot of the young people do not have the choice to get started in farming. When he was uh, in the second grade, uh, they asked him what he really wanted to do, and he said, I want to own the farm at Loop, Texas, you know, and that's pretty good. I have learned a lot from him, and that's, that's been a pretty neat deal, you know, to, to get to do that. It's really been nice to have him to help me along there because he, he, he understands this computer age. You know, he's still doing it. He gets out there, he changes motors on the pivot, he's, he's spraying, he's running tractor, we, he runs the cotton stripper when, when we, it's time to harvest. And so, you know, it's not, he's not a silent partner by any means. Now, I won't see it in my lifetime, but Hayden will see it in his lifetime that uh, It'll be five different generations. He'll see the uh, hundred year uh, history. And, and I think that's great because not very many people keep their land for a hundred years in the family. 